hey hi friends welcome back to my channel so in today's video i am back with the few more job openings with you guys and this opening is specially for the freshers and the experience with at least one plus years of experience if you are holding at least one plus years of experience into the data analytics or any operations kind of role where you are dealing with the data or mathematics or reporting definitely you can look for this video and consider applying for the job opening that i'm going to share in this video okay so the first opening is from the cargill and it is for the analytics reporting engineer so experience wise they are not expecting a very highly experienced person but the, yes for the skills wise they are expecting someone having very good understanding and experience on the power bi python and very good english communications and reporting knowledge and some sort of experience at least bachelor degree in related field and the related skills like sql and hive it is not highly mandatory but it is must to know like the basic knowledge and understanding of these skills okay the main goal or main focus skill over here is power bi and data analytics experience so if you are someone having some sort of data analysis experience plus reporting and want to slightly switch into the bi then definitely you can apply for this opening and try for this particular opportunity our next opening is from infosys and it is for the big data developer uh, the level of experience is three to five years it is not like if you must hold entire three to five years of experience into a uh, big data but yes if you hold some experience of data analysis some sort of language and uh, having good understanding of how you scale a spark you can target this opportunity let's see what is the expectations over here so they are expecting someone having good, very basic architecture and design fundamental knowledge then uh, someone who have worked on the agile methodology and having some project life cycle activity development maintenance and project and all that thing having good communication and presentation skills and basically having some preferred skill of PySpark, Scala and Spark so it is not that difficult if you hold very good understanding of SQL you can learn these skills which is just a cover up of Python, PySpark and uh, Scala you can leverage it and you can apply for this particular job okay the next opportunity is from the impetus and it is for the gcp data engineer and level of experience they're expecting is one to two year into the gcp and any cloud platform and two to three experience into the big data technology like hadoop spark kafka so again it is not mandatory that you must hold entire experience into this field but if you having a very good understanding of big data technology and have some sort of uh, entry level of experience and having a cloud experience of at least one to six month or one to year at least one year definitely you can apply for the job they are not expecting a big thing into the job description but yeah this is something very basic thing that they are expecting as per the opening okay so i'll give the link into the description box you can go ahead and apply for this job <clears throat> the next opportunity is from the accenture again it is for the analytics uh, and analyst the kind of expectation is not very high <coughs> they are expecting someone with a good sql knowledge <coughs> and uh, crm knowledge then vba knowledge and yeah that's it they are not expecting a big thing over here some problem solving skill communication skill are the basic that every job looker every job employer look for okay so i'll give the link in the description box you can go through this job description and make relevant changes to your profile if it is not fitting to your current resume and then apply for the job that way your chance to getting shortlisted for this position will be high the next opportunity is from the Zenpack and it is for the process developer data analyst again they are not expecting a very big thing but yeah let's see what they are expecting they are expecting someone with the operations role 
and someone with the uh, having good understanding of SAP, Oracle and having some basic data analytics skill not big thing uh, some support like say some kind of experience in dashboarding reporting and uh, identifying the gap uh, uh, basic data analysis work basically so you can apply for the job if you feel like you are good fit for this job the last opportunity for this is uh, pwc and it is for the power bi specialist and it is someone who is absolute fresher so expectation wise they are not expecting big thing only two to three of years of experience into rdbms sql power bi reporting power bi dashboard development dax and all and all so if you feel like you're good fit for this job you can go and apply i will give the link into the description box okay all right so that's it for the day guys hope you like this video hit the thumbs up button share your thoughts into the comment section if you are uh, have some sort of query doubts you can feel free to ask into the comment section i will definitely make a video for you guys so that's it if you are preparing for the interview you can look for the live interview playlist on my channel which is a live recorded it is not a mock interview or something so you will get a real feel of interview you will see how to handle a critical things how to handle a uh, different situations into the interview that way you will get some sort of confidence like how to face the interview basically so yeah that's it i uh, will see you in the next video till then take care bye bye